All right, campfire cooking time, campfire meals. Uh, what we're doing tonight is a little bit of beans and franks, some onions, but that's not the main attraction. If you're a prepper, I got something to show you that you are going to want to add to your prepper pantry. Stay tuned. All right, guys, welcome back to Prepping with Sarge. Today, I am going to show you a little something that some of you have probably never heard of bread in a can I tell you this stuff is really good I'm not I'm not I'm not messing with you uh, yes the MRE bread crackers are really good too some of you uh, do your own you know uh, grinding of your of your grains and that kind of thing and and have ways to do that but I know some preppers are on small space or just don't really want to get into that this bread in a can is a good solution you need to stack this in your prepper pantry now the problem is not all regions have that I actually uh, that's very common in New England, up in Massachusetts. I actually had to have my dad send me that down to South Carolina. Let's crack this open. I want to show you this. And by the way, the best way to enjoy this brown bread in a can is with beans and franks. So I'm curious, those of you who are watching, have you ever seen this before? Have you ever seen this brown bread in a can? And I know some of my viewers are checking in from Massachusetts area. So if any of you have not seen it, I would be very surprised. This was, this was pretty common up there. All right, oh, it didn't pop up, hang on. There we go. That's what it looks like. I have to tell you, it smells really good. It's like a molasses smell. Now getting it out sometimes can be the tricky part. And there used to be a trick, but I don't remember the trick. If any of you remember, if any of you remember the trick, let me know. Come on. Okay, I remembered the trick. So I cut off both ends and then you can just push it through. So that's what it looks like. And then you, the way to slice it is like this. You want to have a good bread knife. It will, sometimes it will break apart, but look at that. And this brown bread, I'm telling you, is also really good with, it. the best way to have it is with the beans and the franks, but it's also very good with cream cheese, and it's also very good toasted on the grill. So we're just gonna go ahead and cut some slices here. Oops, see, and that's what happens. Sometimes it will break apart. Uh, you know what, that's because I had a, a little dent in the can that's what it's it's breaking exactly where the dent was but there you go that's what it looks like i'm gonna go ahead and have a little piece now while i'm waiting for my beans and my franks it's so good it's like a molasses bread that's the best way to describe it definitely got brown sugar in there good stuff you all need to add this to your proper pantry i'm telling you All right, folks, I am ready to dig in. We have our baked beans. Just slather some right on there with the, right in there with the mustard. We got our franks, we got our brown bread. We got something else to give you guys cheers with. Cheers. Oh yeah. With the onions grilled on the cast iron like that, it is off the hook. Now, I know what you're waiting for. You want it to see this brown bread. What are we gonna do with this? We're gonna take a piece of this brown bread. We're gonna dip it into those baked beans. Oh yeah, baby. Check that out. Folks, if you enjoy my content, please give me a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. Do all kinds of outdoor videos, foraging, wilderness survival, uh, self-sufficiency, and sometimes we just do some campfire meals. I'm gonna shut off the video so I can enjoy the rest of this. Y'all have a great night. Keep planting your seeds, keep stacking your silver. This is Prepping with Sarge.